Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me So, morning snack, got a waffle, sort of caramel bar with some caramel latte. Yeah. This is the new lamp, lampshade lighting feature we got today. I like it. I love yeah, it. Yeah, I feel like it's got Epcot vibes. I don't know, everything's got Epcot vibes <laughs> to us. <laughs> but it kind of puts a shadow down the room, which is really cool. And this was from Iconic Lights. I think it was like $14.99. And it feels pretty good quality. Looks no good finding that. Yeah, I'm really chuffed with it. And I fitted it as well. <laughs> so this is the spare room. It's the smallest room. And this is the room that I share as my study with the cats. <laughs> so normally I'll have obviously stuff along here, which we've cleared down. And then I'll have my desk over there. But we're going to mix this room up and reorganize it. Um, but this is the room that has the loft hatch. So this room has been decorated but it needs new carpet at some point because it's quite marked. So at some point we'll get a new carpet in here. We're going to put the desk back over here I think and then the cats are going to have their little sofa area here. So we'll show you when it's done. Good evening. Have we even been <laughs> on camera today? I don't think so. It's been one of those days. Uh, so we um, obviously had the handyman in from straight away plus working, so we've not been able to do much vlogging today. No, it's been very noisy as well, so hence why the camera's also not been out. Yeah, drilling, soaring. Banging. <laughs> <laughs> so the cats have been having a Disney Plus day again. Yeah, they watched Aladdin, Little Mermaid, um, I think if you put Finding Dumbo. Nemo. Dumbo. Dumbo and Finding Nemo. <laughs> yes, they have the fish. <laughs> so the loft is all done. So uh, we had a couple of questions actually about loft. I think in the States, a loft means something different. So like a room? Here it's an attic. Yeah. It's the attic. And we've had it all boarded out so we've got space to put all of our Disney mugs that we can't fit in the cupboard. <laughs> <laughs> so Luke's sending me up now to um, have a look. Yeah, we're really, really chuffed with it actually. Yeah, we are, yeah. He put a big light up there, mm -hmm. the ladder, and he boarded it out to a really good usable area. Yeah. So I've actually not, Luke saw it earlier, that's why I'm going up now to have a look. So, yeah, yeah, I was up there with them. Um, the guy up there before having a good look. Yes, yeah, so it's my so, turn now. <laughs> yeah, so let's show you the newly finished a slight lot. interval to proceedings <laughs> as Willow has come for a lot of love and she's very loving. Yeah, you're very loving. Have you been locked up all day watching Disney Plus? It's a movie day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I went to give her treats earlier as well. <laughs> yeah. She's been happy. She's very happy to be released from the living room. Yeah. We're going to make your bedroom up. She's mm -hmm. missed you today, hasn't she? I missed you. Oh. Are you getting cuddles now? Yeah. That's it. She thinks she thinks she's being taken back downstairs. No, <laughs> Look at those it. big paws. Right, we're going to go back with the loft yeah, the ladder. Now. And there we are, straight into the hatch. So we've got a handle on this one. We didn't have a handle on our last yeah, one. Yeah, we've got a handle. So am I going up? You're going up. I won't film you going up, but we'll, we'll meet. <laughs> Here we go. I'm going to pass you up to Rich now. He's going to take we you around. We are in the loft. <laughs> so, are you going to wave? Hello. There he is. <laughs> So yeah, this is the um, this is the loft. So we actually got the handyman to help us up with a suitcase and a, a crate, just so we can make sure that those bulky things cleared the hatch, because the hatch isn't that big. Um, it's a little bit smaller than our last one, but we're getting the suitcases up and we're getting the crates up. So that's that's the main thing. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go back so you can kind of see. So it is actually quite a big space and we decided not to go all the way to the edge because we just felt like we didn't need it. So we've got all the space over that side and then all the space over, even in there and all along there. Um, but we'll go all the way back. And then he did like a, um, a little step up. So there was a, this bit was a bit tricky um, due to what's underneath. So we had to go up slightly, um, but yeah, he did a really good job there. But yeah, we're really, really happy. We've got lots of space. I don't think we'll need to fill it all, but it's good that we've got the extra storage space. Um, but yeah, we're very, very happy. Oh, another thing I forgot to mention is we've got one of these light beam things um, because the light that we had over there just wasn't doing enough. So 
Um, he kindly nipped into uh, a local trade store and picked one of those lights up for us, so he's installed that as well. And we've also got some spare boards up there from what was left from the previous owners that we didn't use this time, but we could potentially put them along here to create some shelves. Um, or we've also got a little landing bit up here. Um, yeah, food for thought. And we're done. Welcome to the cat's new boudoir. Yeah. <laughs> so they've got their little rug on the floor. I think that yeah. was B and M. The sofa is from IKEA, and it's a gloss dad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my desk is there. Obviously, I've got to put the computer on there. We've just spent about 15, 20 minutes working out where things would be best placed. So I think yeah. we've settled on the best scenario. Yeah. Need some artwork on the wall. Yeah, the walls are a bit bare, so we, you know. But they're gonna have their little bed here. We're gonna get some cushions and a blanket. Yeah. And that's their little comfy little room with my study. So I've got two cats with me when I'm working. <laughs> Finished all the furniture. We are now waiting for our online delivery. We've gone with Sainsbury's this week. We do vary. And we booked one of their saver slots, which is from like 3 p.m. till 7 p.m. We've ended up with the 6 till 7 p.m. So it's always a gamble, know exactly what we're getting into. So we had planned to have dinner from the Sainsbury's order, but obviously it's gonna to be too late. So we are gonna grab something from the freezer and we know exactly what it is. And um, we're gonna show you If now. you saw our Costco vlog, we bought the yakisoba noodles. They take five minutes. And actually we've got a couple of spare ones from the last pack here. So they're so good, it's just so easy and quick to do. So we're gonna have those tonight. So let's make them. are in. We'll show you when they're done. Hope you won't be long. We are now testing out our new light from Iconic Lighting. Um, it's really cozy actually, isn't it? So nice. It's gonna go on, eventually get a drink trolley in it, kind of the pineapple theme. But it is, so we can, oh. So we just tap the base and then it adjusts the brightness. But it's like it's pineapple. It's gonna like Luke says. It's gonna go on the drinks trolley when we get a drinks trolley. It's like navy gold. It's, and it was, I think it was forty-one pounds, but they were doing fifteen percent off. So I think check out their Insta because they they've got a code like Insta fifteen or something. Time for some noodles. So these are the yakisoba noodles which we bought from Costco. Yeah. It smells so good. Lots of veggies. Um, and we're gonna have a side salad with them as well. I've got my side salad with um, salmon flakes this time. Oh, and I just got, got a just, nice... Just plain. We had to use the lettuce because it came, um, was running out today, so we've got to use it up. So we're gonna show you some festive bits, maybe some non-festive bits that came in the, actually it's all festive that came in the shop. Yeah, the, the Sainsbury's arrived. Yep. And we got a few bits. So we're gonna start over here with some classic honey roasted peanuts. You can't have Christmas without honey roasted peanuts, I'm sorry. And just happening. to say, we are showing you the the, the naughty stuff. <laughs> we do have in the in the in the um, <laughs> in the fridge we've got new potatoes, mushrooms, peppers, yes. vegetables, tomatoes, the but lot. You, you've but seen all those. You don't need to see that. <laughs> this no. is the fun stuff. <laughs> um we've got some pigs in blankets flavour tortillas. Which we didn't actually order, they're a substitute, but we're not we'll going to say it. It, give it a try. Yeah. Uh, we've got some festive Pringles, sour cream and onion. We've also got salt and vinegar and prawn cocktail. But this one has the festive branding, yeah. which looks cool. I like it. Um, Luke also picked us up each a um, selection box. I think it's just a classic, um, I don't know whether it's just a, a UK thing, but to have that in your stocking, it reminds me of when I was younger. Do you remember the ones that were in like nets? Yes, I remember those. <laughs> <laughs> they go in your stocking and it's just a Christmas thing, so had to get those. Had to get those. We've got Crunchy Whisper Fudge. I think I'll be having double Luke's decker. Fudge. Double Decker. Double Decker. We'll trade off. Luke can have my Double Decker and I'll have his fudge. Yeah. And they're doing a free, t free Merlin ticket, so maybe next oh. year we'll go to one of the Merlin parks. It's park. been so long since I've been to like Legoland <laughs> or it's been a long time. Thorpe Park, yeah. Um, also, we've we've um, <laughs> completed, the, completed set. the set. So we've got the Cadbury's Heroes. We've already got roses, celebrations, and Quality Street. And quality street. <laughs> so the family are pretty kitted out for chocolates this year, for sure. Yeah. Um, we've got some bread sauce for the turkey, which yeah. comes in recyclable paper packaging now. Ah, cool. That's yeah. yours for your turkey on Christmas. Yep. Yeah. Then we've got some cheeses that Luke picked out. So we've got some cheddar with garlic and herbs. Smoky cheddar, gotta love smoky cheddar. And Wensleydale and cranberry. Gotta have some Wensleydale. <laughs> um, yeah, so good choices there. 
And we also got some chutneys just for the cheeses. So we got a apple and pear chutney. Yep. A warm, warm and spiced Christmas chutney. And this one we actually didn't order, but it was a substitution. Um, and the way Sainsbury's works is if it's a substitution, you get a credit back for the difference. So we ended up with a better brand, so it worked out well. Yeah. And that is all the goodies. Good evening. Good evening. Do not know where today has gone. It's been busy, <laughs> but it's been good. Yeah, it has been a good day and success with the loft as well. Really happy we've got that done. Yeah, Vlogmas day 14 today, isn't it? Yeah. And that means it's 10 days till Christmas Eve. Luke is like counting I'm down. I'm starting to every get excited second now. Of every day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really starting to feel the festiveness now. Yeah. Um, I've got a little Christmas lunch tomorrow with work. It's only a small thing. That'd be nice. Just though. a few of us going for a drink. Um, we had originally planned to have like a Christmas party on the Friday, but we've, they've cancelled that. So we're going to go virtual on Friday. Mm -hmm. so we'll tell you more about that. Yeah. But starting with the Genevieve advent today. But we'll switch it up. We'll start with Genevieve first. Yeah. Yeah. And is it my turn to open? Your turn to open and my turn to guess. To yeah. read. Okay. Let's yeah. give you the clue and we'll okay. find out. So yeah, our shopping arrived. We just unloaded all the shopping. Um, it's nice mixing between Sainsbury's, Asda, Ocado and actually going to like Aldi. We like mixing between the supermarkets, don't we? Yeah. It's difficult to get slots at the moment. Don't we slots? Here we go. Here we go. Okay. So question. This tiny character received worldwide fame when he debuted on Disney Plus. It wasn't until a year later that his name was revealed. Who is he and what is his name? Oh my God, <laughs> it's a really tough one. <laughs> That's actually quite tough. Do you know? I, no, I think it's actually quite tough for you. Okay, I'm gonna have a look. Can you give me any indication? It's Star Wars related. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> This should be you opening this. Yeah, we've got the wrong way around this one. <laughs> Let's have a look. Did you get it right? It is. It's Baby Yoda Grogu. Little green man. <laughs> <laughs> if, I... <laughs> if you like Uno, enjoy this other card game that just came out with Baby Yoda. This is so cool. I'm going to pass it over to you because you're the Star Wars guy. <laughs> um, Thank you so much, Genevieve. Oh, thank you so much. I've never seen that this before. That looks fun. We'll have to dig that out on yeah. Christmas. Perfect for Christmas. So, yeah, we're going to play this over the uh, festive period. Yeah. Forget what I, know. I must say, although I'm not into Star Wars as such, I, I must say um, I was named after Star Wars. My parents called me Luke after Luke Skywalker. Um, but the theming and everything, Galaxy's Edge and the rides and Rise of the Resistance, I have great respect for all of that. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. Instead, so I'm just reading on the back here. It says, you can combine this game with any other Star Wars something wild game for an even wilder time. Okay, we're going to look into that. Which so is if you're interested, <laughs> that's what it looks like. Looking and it looks really fun. <laughs> looking forward to that. Are we going to be booking you a trip on the Star Cruiser? Is that what it's called? <laughs> yeah, but if... Um... <laughs> we'll, we'll see what the reviews we'll are like. We'll see what first. the reviews are like, yeah. <laughs> we'll let um, other people try it first. <laughs> So we've got some lovely, um, lovely emails to go through. The one thing I want to say is I, I love reading all the comments and it's amazing all around the world, people watching us. So yeah. like obviously US, Canada, Australia, and we just had a message from Nicholas in Auckland, New Zealand. It says, thank you so much for your blogs. I've missed them so much this year and you both bring me so much happiness with Blogmas. And you've also sent us a Costa voucher. So thank, thank, thank you, you so much. much. That's so yeah, kind. That's very kind of you. I can't believe it. So now it must be like morning in Auckland. So our Vlogmas must go live in the evening if you watch it when it goes live. I'm glad you've got your head around that. <laughs> so good evening to Wednesday, if you're watching Nicholas. From the future. That makes my mind. <laughs> yeah. That's a bit much for a That's Tuesday, a bit much, but yeah, yeah, thank you. <laughs> but yeah, thank you very much. And always appreciate a kind message like that. We got a lovely message from Joanne and Andrew in Texas, in Houston. So um, hopefully you're still holding on to some warm <laughs> Weather in That's Houston. That's why whenever I think about Texas, I always think hot weather. Yeah, I think it does get cold though. It's, it does snow sometimes. Yeah, I'll only accept hot weather in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much for your lovely message. Um, really, really nice. And also a picture of your Disney tree, which is Love different. It. A different yeah, type of different tree. Different type of tree, yeah. It's really nice. Shall I let you go with some comments and I'll get some more? Yeah. Um, I've got the, the quiz. Yes. No. I, I've done it again. I've done it again. Rich steals the quiz. If <laughs> I get in there really early. Um, so... Yesterday's question was, how many fingers does Mickey Mouse have? Did you know? I actually didn't, haven't ever paid that much attention to Mickey's <laughs> hand. But one, two, three, four. Four. Three fingers and a thumb. 
There we go, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Something I didn't know, and actually I'll pay attention to next time. Pay attention. I've actually just noticed that this Christmas Mickey's got like a bean bag. Ah. In his bum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, um, <laughs> uh, well done to Jess. So love now my mind. <laughs> well done to Jess. Does Mickey have four fingers? Yes. How funny that the amount of times we all look at him, we all have to take a minute to think. Don't really look at his hands. No, <laughs> really that's a very random question. Yeah. Um, Stephanie Harmon. Um, I love how you pamper your sweet kitties. I miss having a cat. But unfortunately, I found out I was allergic. Aww. Oh, um, that's a shame. Mickey has three fingers and a thumb on each hand. Thinking I might need to look into one of those hot chocolate machines. Yes, the Velvetizer. And actually, I have to say, um, a few of you messaged us, actually. Sorry, I haven't got names, but it was definitely... Um, three or four of you and, and sent pictures that apparently Aldi do their own chocolate that you can use in the Velvetizer. Yes. Two ninety nine, <laughs> rather than obviously the nine fifty whatever it is, eleven fifty that. Mm. So we're going to go to Aldi and find that. Thank you. Um, and then Kristen McGarry, um, the whole setup for the kitties is so dang cute. Uh, Mickey has four fingers, at least in the parks. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so yeah, so thank you everyone for commenting and well done to everyone who got it right. Cool. And for guessing as well. Before today's question, I've got a few more yep. comments here. So a lovely email from Leah, um, who actually says we briefly met you in Magic Kingdom in September 2019 during Mickey's Not So Scary. Oh. It was my birthday. So um, I hope you had a lovely birthday. Yeah, nice to have met you there. Yeah, lovely to meet you. Um, you're buying a flat and can't wait to own your own miniature village. Good to do it. And also, we often find the garden centres have them on sale. We got a lot of our miniature village in on the sale. Mm -hmm. I think they were like £7, something like that. We generally don't pay full price, do we? We get them the following year, or like in mid-year. And you've also said, can you say Merry Christmas to my friend Claire? She's your biggest fan and person introduced me to your channel. Oh, oh thank you, Merry Claire. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And one more, just a quick one from Annie and Bonnie in Glasgow. Um, and he ordered some goodies from the garlic farm. Ah, oh, yes. That is a good call. We loved it there, didn't we? And um, Bonnie is very cute and your tree is brilliant. So well thank done. You. Thank, thank you. So you. And thank you everyone who's messaging in to us. We read every single one. Yeah. And today's quiz question is? Is? Day 14. Yeah, it's cat related. So Duchess is a mother to how many kittens in the Aristocats? Uh, as you know, if you watched, the cats were watching the Aristocats. <laughs> was it yesterday or today? Yeah, I think they're exhausted from their Disney. They probably know more about Disney than we do now. Yeah, so today they watch Dumbo and Aladdin and yeah. <laughs> so yeah, comment below. The um, loft is obviously done as you've seen, so we've got mm -hmm. no disruption tomorrow. I've got to go to work for a bit. You're at home. I'm at home, yeah. I'll be home in the afternoon. Um, Maybe I'll get back into that Fortnum and Mason's tea because I'm a little bit behind, <laughs> even though I'm determined not to fall behind. Yeah, and we're seeing one of our friends tomorrow night, um, so that'll be nice. Yep. Um, no names. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, we look forward to seeing you all tomorrow for day 15. 15. Yeah. See you later. See ya.